Hello and welcome back to All About Community. Again, my name is Robert L. Harris. I am your host and my guest is Mayor Elihu Harris, who is a former mayor right here in the city of Oakland. Elihu, when we went to break, we were talking about the House of Representatives uh, and the changing of leadership from uh, the Democrats to the Republicans. But something new has happened, unprecedented has happened. One of our Kappa brothers, Kappa Alpha Psi, paternity brothers, uh, Hakeem Jeffries will be the minority leader. Uh, speak to that. Well, what first do you of think? all, it's not just a change in terms of race. This is a young man. Uh, he's 30 years younger than the previous speaker, the previous Democratic leader. He brings that energy. Uh, he brings that confidence. And more important, he brings that creativity. Uh, he comes out of Brooklyn, uh, as does Schumer. So now you have the leaders of the Senate and the leader of the House for the Democrats, both being Brooklyn Democrats. Uh, it's going to be interesting to see what he's able to do with a new leadership team. Uh, all the Almost all the older people have been replaced by a younger generation of leaders uh, in the Congress. And I think it's going to be exciting to see the energy they bring, uh, the willingness to try different approaches to old problems. And quite frankly, uh, an infusion of youth is always a good thing. That demographic change, I think, is going to play many dividends for the Democrats in the House of Representatives in the 2024 elections. Now, uh, Mayor Harris, I know our time is running out, but you as a former mayor of the city, having led the city for eight years, and prior to that, uh, your long tenure in the legislature, so you have a lot of wisdom. So if you were given advice, and I know you love to give advice, <laughs> uh, Sometimes it's not accepted. <laughs> but if you were giving advice to the new mayor of Oakland, what advice would you give to uh, Mayor uh, uh, Shang Tao? Two things. One, uh, listen, be collaborative, uh, be humble. Because, uh, quite frankly, it's a very humbling job. Uh, you may think you have all the answers, but quite frankly, you need everyone in the city to work with you, to feel they have a responsibility. But more importantly, that we're all in this together, regardless of race, religion, economics. Any kind of demographic divide has to be overcome with a mayor providing leadership for all the people. You know, the old adage that uh, Walter Fauntroy used to say, we all came here in different uh, ships, now we're all in the same boat. I think it's very important 